Finally, welcome back to Pokemon White Let's Play Retrospective. Now we should be able to enter it, right? Let's check our Pokemon. Will we get auto healed? Well, I guess I can use the PC to cheese my way around this. Let's do it like this. First, we heal Latias. Then, we heal Bravery. Then we heal the B Magnusome. Then we heal the last Pokemon. Let's check it out. Everyone seems to be in tip top shape. Let's check it out. We want to use our Quirky Latias, our Bashful Extra Drill, our Zorak, which we received from N. Brave Bird, everything, Magni Zone, and Angry Girl, who still uh, gathers some experience so it can destroy everything. Let's teach some new moves we received. And the move I am thinking about teaching is. If I can find it, Focus Blast. The move that always misses. Let's get rid of Shadow Ball, we don't need it. And then we finally enter this place. It will take a while, but there are a lot of strong Pokemon awaiting us to destroy. Oh, there's the first trainer. We need to find the boss first. And then... There is a doctor at least that will heal us in every... Okay, she can't see me from this range. Each defeating trainer will give us a hint. Ah, oh, she explains to you how this works. Okay. She still wants that we follow her. There are some trainers that are spinning. She is not in this direction. Let's follow these. I don't really need to. Be careful, ah, uh, there she is. Ah, uh, she's just some kind of uh, helping with explaining how the roots are. We still didn't battle anyone yet, so we don't need to worry about it. There's the nurse, definitely defeats the nurse first. So you can always backtrack and heal. And if the nurse is too strong, yes, that would be a problem. She has two Pokemon. The first is a real, which is going to give some attack IVs to our angry girl. We can be a bit greedy. Level 48 is not much. I think any of our Pokemon right now can defeat her. The first trainers are usually the easiest. But it will progressively get more difficult. Next is Snower. Snower is really annoying with its hail, but we can one shot it, so nothing to worry about. In today's Pokemon episode I watched, we also saw a Latias. In, I'm not really and much of a fan of Pokemon, the Pokemon anime, but I really enjoy that it's a childhood series and it's nice to see let's or not. Okay, let's find out if she's worthy. 
she's a battle girl, so I think she uses fighting types, but yeah, it's a little bit. What else to think? And this one is two levels higher than the one from the nurse. But it's level still level 50, we are like 24 levels higher and a psychic type and we get the soul do boost. So there's nothing she can challenge us with. Ekans, I think we talked about Ekans coil boosted. <coughs> coil really helped it out a bit. With Shed Skin you can use a defensive core set with Intimidate, you can go for a more offensive core set. Well, it's a really neat Pokemon. Okay, and now we get the gate open. You just need to find it. The first trainer is the strongest trainer inside. Don't need let's heal regardless. It's but she heals us just once. Uh, I guess. Okay, this is how it works. You have she heals you just once, then not again. But I had I had in mind that she heals you more than once. But in this regard, it doesn't really matter. Let's see what what Pokemon Daisy has. So what I oh a uh, seal. Seal evolves to Walrein. Walrein in Hell is broken because if Hell is set up, you get recovery from Ice Body, and you can sub protect the toxic your opponent, and they can't do anything. People just run surf because it has the most PP. You can wear down your opponent with <laughs> protecting and slapping. And if you have enough book investments, they can never one hit KO you. And they are slowly getting worn down. I think like many, so many people I know have been one hit KO'd by a uh, ball ring. And they'll start out ball stall ring. But I like about it now that the Pokemon anime is getting it actually it ended the main story but now you have a few specials. And in these specials Ash is rotating his team, so you will see a lot of old Pokemon for his really short special adventures and it's nice to see and in that latest episode he has found a uh, um, damaged Latias and nursed him to good health. And what I liked is the uh, Pokemon used uh, he used Dongfan, he used Skeptal, he used Neuven and he used Breezel. And next episode I think he will use Totodile. The only Jotunian starter that needs to evolve. <laughs> it's the only one that hasn't evolved. I think some old Pokemon really deserve an evolution at this point. Like, is Totodile really that popular that it needs to stay out Totodile? I don't really get it. I think the Johto starters are one of the most forgettable ones, but it's not like I don't like them. I actually prefer them over a lot of other starters. Oh, let's speed up this police guy. And do these trainers actually give us money? We will find out. Champo, and he has a Krabby. Krabby normally has the only useful ability is Hypercutter, which prevents it attack stats to be lowered. But from the Dream World, it gets Sheer Force. So all secondary ability moves get boosted, sadly, except the ones that crit. Sadly, moves that do critical damage don't get boosted, so it doesn't get sheer force boost for crab hammer, and in this generation it still can't learn um, waterfall. So peop the only attack that gets boosted is 
rocks light. So people still use hypercutter, sword dance set with crab hammer and I guess rock slide and I don't know what else Kingler can learn. So Kingler is pretty much a disappointing fellow. Let's drown this Let's draw this uh, swine up and then we can continue. Let's see, is this the gate? Not yet. There's the gate. And there's the boss train. Let's see how powerful she is. So she's challenging. We are going to enter the battle with the boss trainer. She has three Pokemon. First one is Watchhog. Really? You have a Watchhog? Must be some kind of silly joke, but I guess not. Let's go for Psychic. Because why not? we defeated Watchhogs, the next Pokemon is this thing. I guess we can sum up with it too. It's not even fully evolved, I don't understand what this what the deal is. So we one hit KO that Pokemon 2. Next is Golad, which is immune to electric. So we are going to drown it in, in the sea. And with this we defeated the boss trainer. Well done. And I really didn't pay attention if we got money. But I assume we got a lot of money. And we got iron. So, was it area 1? Welcome, welcome. Hello. Challenge. Okay, we defeated area 1. Now we can go to area 2. We will see each other in the next video. Wish us luck.